Hi, I'm Brad Dillon. Welcome to the Dennis Dillon RV and Marine Show. Our weekly program focuses on RVs and boats in all shapes and sizes. Whether it's a family boat, competition ski or surf boat, tent trailer, travel trailer, toy hauler, fifth wheel, class C motorhome, class A motorhome, or a diesel pusher, we have everything there is to offer at Dennis Dillon RV and Marine. Enjoy the show. Hi, my name is David Schmutz with Dennis Dillon RV and Marine. We're here to talk to you about the full line of Class C 2014 models that we have in store for you, starting from the most affordable and going from there. We're here to talk to you about the Coachman Freelander, first of all. This is model 21QB, the shortest one that they make. This one comes with the 4500 Chevy chassis, the 6.0 engine. As we come around to this side, as you can see, we have fiber fiberglass molded steps, so easy access into both doors. Gel coat siding. This siding has, as you notice, the color on it is a little bit brown and that is a HD fiberglass. So if you were to scratch it, that color is impregnated into the glass and uh, it won't show the scratch. Storage here. Over here, you've got your Onan 4000 gas generator. And right here, we have the Atwood six gallon direct spark ignition water heater. Your fuel fill over here, city water connection, your potable water connection, and this is for your cable TV at the parks. We're here to talk about the 5,000 pound tow capabilities with the hitch and the seven way plug that's included. Beautiful storage from both the back as well as the side. A ladder to get on the roof, which is a full walk on roof and you can get up there and uh, maybe have a beer and watch a game or something. Huge entry door from the side to that storage below. You can use this as additional storage as well as put another flat screen TV in here if you'd like. Your propane bottle is down here. Let's take a look at the inside of the Coachman Freelander 21QB. To start off with, over here we have a flat screen Jensen TV which is on an arm so you can be able to see it from any angle. Also it comes with a DVD player right up here. Beautiful above, uh, above bed. Your U-shaped dinette makes a bed as well as you have a rear bed so this will sleep six comfortably. As we come up into here as you'll notice there's no carpet on the floor anywhere so it's going to be easier to keep clean and you don't have carpet that will wear out on you. It's got cruise control, tilt wheel, power mirrors, power door locks, and power windows all included. This coach comes with a single sink, high rise faucet, and additional countertop space. Stove, oven, spark ignition so you don't have to use a lighter, microwave, hood fan, lighting, wonderful storage, two-door refrigerator, freezer above, refrigerator below, the rear bed, wonderful storage above the bed all the way around, huge closet space. And if you'll notice, your heater ducts or in your cabinets down below and not right down in the floor where you're stepping on them. Nicely arranged bathroom with a glass shower enclosure as well as your sink. That's a look at the Coachman 21QB. A little later in the show, I've got more to show you. Hi, I'm Dave Wilkin with Dennis Dillon RV and Marine in Boise, Idaho. I'm here today to introduce you to the 2014 Tioga Montera by Fleetwood. 
This product offers a front fiberglass cap and Fleetwood's gel coated one piece tough coat exterior. This particular coach is on a Ford 350 chassis and a Triton V10. The coach offers one of the largest slide outs in its size. This is a 25K, it's only a 25 foot coach and that is a 10 foot slide. Equipped on this coach is an Onan generator and that is the RVGQ4000. It's a very quiet running gasoline uh, generator. Runs off from the main fuel tank of the coach. This coach offers more storage than any other unit in its class. For example, there are two pass-through storage components or compartments that will actually allow you to go up over the frame rails to put long objects in like boat oars, tent poles, things like that. This coach features an outside shower. It is both hot and cold. Also equipped on this coach is an automatic slide topper. That prevents leaves and debris getting on top of your slide out. Fleetwood conveniently places the gas fill at the rear of the coach. By doing this, it allows you to fill from either aisle at a gas station. You don't have to maneuver into a particular side, so it's straight in anywhere to fill the fuel tank. Also standard on this coach from the factory is a 5,000 pound receiver hitch and seven-way wiring. This coach offers more storage than any motorhome in its class. There's an overabundance of what you really need. Also on this coach is an outside entertainment center. This gives you AM, FM, CD, speakers, and provisions to hook up an outside TV, either being a 12 volt or 110. This comes off from your switcher inside, so any source or function that you switch on is what you can see outside as well as inside. This unit features a full coach awning, so the days it's raining or just getting out of the sun covers all of your awning side. So let's go on in and see what we have to offer here. This coach offers a really good ceiling height, uh, a lot of room for the times when you have guests. It's a full 54 by 80 queen bed. Also the dinette makes down to a bed, very easily done. Also, Fleetwood installs seat belts anywhere a passenger can sit in one of their vehicles. Hidden hinges are some of the quality points that you'll find only in a much higher end, usually a diesel product. Storage underneath the dinette, very important in these. Dometic, gas or electric, it's a fully automatic refrigerator. And you can see that's in the slide out along with your, your dinette. Moving to the top of this unit, this is really important. This is a, a material that is sound deadening. Also gives you another insulation factor. And these are a crowned roof, so water will not set up on the top. In the galley, uh, a lot of storage. Uh, again, solid, solid uh, cabinetry in it, good storage below. Uh, oven and a microwave. Uh, a little different than, than what's going on in the industry today. Uh, compartment for your coffee maker, so it's completely stowed out of the way. You don't have to get it out. They use uh, components uh, that you would find in your home. This is a made down RV queen bed. You don't have to make up your bed uh, each morning and, and night. Good storage above throughout the, the coach. Uh, one feature is having a separate lavvy to the bathroom, so if someone's using that facility, you can still wash your hands or vice versa. Fleetwood uses quality components like a real porcelain toilet with a foot flush. Also in the shower, you have uh, your skylight giving you just that much more additional headroom. Also a 12 volt fan. This coach does have an optional swing out TV. You can add other components to this. It has a switching system. You can add satellite, DVD, any of the other components that you would want. Uh, another nice feature on this coach is all your controls that you would need to do for the coach are in one area and that tells you all the levels of uh, the tanks and the battery condition, things like that. Also, your slide out control is right here. That's a quick view of the Montera 25K. Please come down to the store and let me go over the things that, that were too numerous for me to mention about this motorhome and take one for a test drive. Hi, this is David Schmutz again with Dennis Dillon RV and Marine in Boise, Idaho. We're looking at the 29KS Coachman Freelander. We've already talked about the gel coat siding, the 6.0 liter Chevy engine, the Chevy 4500 chassis. We've talked about the molded fiberglass steps entering your, both your passenger and your driver's door. 
Now let me show you some of the differences on the 29KS that we didn't offer on the other floor plan. This coach offers ample rear storage underneath your bedroom with rotocast plastic so it's easy to keep clean if something does get spilled. You've got 5,000 pound pull right hitch, backup camera, rear ladder, and full walk-on roof. This coach comes with an outside refrigerator so if you have steaks or beverages, you've got easy access without going inside. Over here you've got an outside kitchen so you can go ahead and grill those steaks, get a pop, this slides up in seconds and goes right into the compartment. And if you decide you want to sit out here and watch a ball game or something else, you can, so you don't have to go inside and wonder what just happened. There's a lot of similarities between this and the 21 QB we were in. Um, and then there's differences, such as the floor plan itself. They both offer the overhead bed with 350 pound capacity. They both have the Jensen flat screen TV with the swing arm. They both have the DVD player. They both have seat belts in both your dinette and your couch. Now let's talk about some of the things that are different. A spice rack to put all your spices. A double sink. High rise faucet again and pantry storage as well. Your bathroom area offers pocket doors, both between the bedroom and the bathroom and the main living area in the bathroom. Ample medicine cabinet storage. Three drawers with full extension roller guides and storage underneath the sink. Your toilet and your shower area are separate, so if somebody was wanting to come from the bedroom into the main part of the coach, you don't get disturbed. This coach offers a full residential queen bed, as well as ample storage on both sides of the bed, whether it be for water, books, or even a sleep out machine, and you've got 110 plug-ins on each side of the bed to plug something in as well. Both sides have drawers, wonderful storage, and closet space. That's a wrap on the Coachman Freelander 29KS. Stick around, we have more coming up. This is another Fleetwood product. It's the Jamboree Sport. This is a 31-foot motorhome, Class C. Some of the differences in this to the other Fleetwood that I just showed you is we're going to a heavier chassis. This is a 450 Super Duty with a Triton V10. Also, we're picking up a chrome package, pointed a little bit nicer at this model. Also integrated into the mirrors are side cameras. These are an infrared camera that will also allow you to see what's down your side uh, at night. And that's activated by simply turning on your turn signal, either left or right. It shows you in the rear camera monitor what's down your sides. This is also a Fleetwood Tough siding that's gel coated. One of the difference is there is no vinyl stripes on this coach. This is all paint. So no vinyl to check uh, 30, 40 years down the road. One of the upgrades are things like slam latches. So you don't have any twists to do, uh, closing your compartments. Also standard on this coach is a power awning. That's just driven out uh, electrically with a button. You can also adjust these for drainage or just if you prefer to have uh, a little wind sheared off from it. Let's go on in. Another difference between this and the last Fleetwood product that I showed you is, of course, the backup camera and, once again, the side cameras that are actuated by your turn signal. Also, the mirrors now become heated and they're power operated, which is a very good plus in, in a motorhome to have that. Again, uh, dinette makes down to a bed. Really importantly, once again, on both sides, you have seat belts uh, anywhere that you can set uh, a person in a Fleetwood product. We're going to a cabinetry upgrade at this level in the Jamboree. Uh, again, hidden hinges with metal struts. Again, the headliner. Uh, you have a built-in surround sound system. It comes with the digital TV antenna. And now our TV is powered, uh, rather than being manual, standard at this level. You can put it wherever you want. Uh, Blu-ray, uh, DVD uh, comes with the unit standard. And then once again, your switcher over here, so you can watch independently three TVs at the same time or have all three programs uh, going on all three TVs at once. 
Uh, once again, in a Fleetwood product, uh, more residential componentry, stainless steel sinks, um, not only microwave, but a gas oven, and a three uh, burner high output range. Ample storage in the coach, you need convenience features like a pull out breadboard. Okay, now once again, the adjustable shelving in, in all the cabinets. Coming down the hall, this is a feature of this coach. It's called a side aisle. Gives you an extra window in the coach and separating your living room from the bedroom by the bathroom that can be closed off independently as well. The bathroom is accessible from either the side aisle or through the master bedroom. We have features in this coach besides the size of the bathroom, but we have a, a residential size shower. It's glass door, one piece surround, ample room for uh, even a big guy like me to get in there and have some elbow room, uh, good storage in the coach, and again, more residential type faucets and fixtures. Air conditioning uh, goes uh, through the coach's ceiling, so we're dispersing it evenly. So even in the bedroom and bathroom, living room, uh, above the front bed, we're getting air conditioning all at the same level. This coach also offers another slide out. This is in the master bedroom. That allows us to have a full residential queen size bed that we can walk around. In the slide out, there are windows that are vented so you can get that nice cross breeze going through in the evening when you, times that you don't need air conditioning. Uh, also having the bed slide gives us a full uh, length closet and we're picking up shoe drawers as well, which are all on uh, metal glides and rollers. Very, very quality constructed coach. Uh, rear TV uh, is standard on this model as well. And that allows you to put it in different positions so it's a little bit easier to, to see. Even though the master bed is in a slide out, we still have storage that they've incorporated on top of the slide mechanism. So those things that are hard to store like guns, fishing poles, extra blankets, pillows, sleeping bags, you have a really good, easy, accessible place to put. So that was a quick review of the Jamboree 31M. We'll see what Dave Schmutz has to show you next. Now I'd like to talk to you a little bit about the 2014 Pleasure Way Prestige. It comes on the F350 Super Duty Ford chassis, molded fiberglass front cap, frameless windows, 2800 watt generator, molded fiberglass wheel wells, and a molded fiberglass rear cap, backup camera, LED lighting, 5,000 pound tow hitch. Now let's talk to you about the outside of the passenger side where you've got a tankless water heater, so if you'd like to take a shower for an hour, you're able to, as well as additional outside storage. Now let's go inside and talk about it for a little bit. Pleasure Way offers a flat screen HD TV, inverter, DVD player, storage in here, wonderful storage up here with hinges that'll keep your doors up, ultra leather furniture, by the way both your seats will turn around and storage above your couch. Well-appointed kitchen with true Corian for your countertops, as well as a backsplash against your walls. Also offers day-night shades. Flush mount two burner range. Recessed under mount sinks and Moen faucet. Your couch also turns into a bed. It's all power, very large for two people. A place for your tabletop to go right here and a flat screen TV that's mounted towards the rear so you can turn both your passenger and driver's chair around and watch it from that angle if you'd like. Closet space, storage, a place to store your table that goes by the couch, convection microwave, 
two-door refrigerator, freezer on top, refrigerator below, storage above that. Fantastic fan. Very well-appointed bathroom that's absolutely huge in this coach. Again, with Corian countertops, undermount sinks, porcelain toilet, and a huge shower that's completely enclosed with Corian and has a adjustable shower head and a skylight above. Pleasure Way puts a lot of craftsmanship in their coaches with an average of 400 man hours per coach in these vehicles. Come on in, see what we have to offer. Hi, it's Dave again. Now we're gonna take a look at some of our used inventory. For example, this is a 2014 Jamboree Searcher by Fleetwood. This is, uh, coach has less than 20,000 miles, uh, fully loaded with all the equipment that we just showed you on some of the new products, uh, right down to a 450 chassis, Triton V10, power awning, uh, outside entertainment. This coach also has the trademark, which is Fleetwood's exterior. That's the gel-coated tough uh, coat. Power step, gas electric hot water heater, and again, that same huge storage compartment that is notorious for the 25K. This is an extremely clean motorhome. Again, less than 20,000 miles on this coach. Has all the creature comforts, as I showed you on the other new coaches, like power mirrors, windows, um, cruise control, tilt, also, the uh, tow system uh, by Ford uh, that allows you to simply kick out the overdrive and change the shifting pattern of the transmission when you're towing. A very nice feature. Uh, once again, backup camera. Uh, 54 by 80 queen bed for your guests. Uh, this coach was standard from the factory with both flooring. Uh, it's a very, very durable flooring uh, with a sweep rail. It's easy to keep the, the sand and and uh, leaves uh, out with uh, not a lot of maintenance while you're out camping. Again, a dinette that makes into a bed. Uh, very easy to do, there's just a release. Uh, slides down, there's no bar in the way, so that allows you uh, access into the dinette. To really